What is up guys and welcome back. I want to apologize for the lull in videos, but uh, my full-time job is quite busy this time of year, so difficult to get videos out as quick as possible. So enough about full-time job, I want to make this my full-time job. So this little skit I've got going here is an awesome little side activity that you can do within Saint Denis. And if you're a new player, then you probably haven't done it, but if you've played for a while, you've probably seen it already. But head over to the Saint Denis pond right over here. It's really the only big enough pond to actually mention within Denis. And in here you're going to speak to a guy and then you're going to be hunting some Red October. Now I want to ask you, listen to the guy's voice. Let me know who it reminds you of. And at the end I'm going to tell you exactly who it is. Alright guys, I'll let this play out. I'll catch you in a bit. Yes, now, now blow up the little battleships and, and avoid the sea mines. They have magnets attached. Make a nasty explosion if they touch the bottom. Okay! If this silly dimwit can use torpedoes on boat to destroy the battleships, imagine what technology can do in the hands of certified genius! And I have certificate. You see what he does? No wire like telegraph, no pulley system underwater, only waves. <laughs> this is remarkable. Think of those poor boys on the HL Hummer. There, all gone for you. Ha ha! You see what he does? Now bring the boat back to the dock. That sure was something. <laughs> Let me just reload her. <laughs> this is really remarkable. This is just a, a demonstration of my prowess, sir. <laughs> the real miracles require investment. <laughs> ah. Now the dimwit will use invisible waves to destroy the little sailing boats before they get to other side of pond, still avoiding magnetic mines. No, I will attempt to at least. Shush! You're not here for this smart talk. The steam train, the telegraph machine, the motor car. They will all seem pedestrian in comparison to this technology. We are not reliant on wires or coal or gasoline. No, just rays in the air. Like the voice of God. And funding from us. And funding from you, of course. But what thing to fund? What an opportunity! No one is stupid enough to pass this up. Not even Dimwit here. Hey, you really all work on your salesmanship. <laughs> Americans, all you think about is sales! Carefully, the gurus of seas. Very good, very good. Now bring in the boat back here. As I say, any fool, huh? Thank you, thank you. What is that? It is the stuff of life, sir. It's incredible. No, no, no. Incredible things are in my lab back at Dover Hill. That will astound all of you. Mr. Marcel, can I count on your support? Well, this is expensive. It is immortality, sir. It is, it is very cheap. Perhaps over lunch. Maybe. I'm gonna go. Oh, yeah, of course. And, and thank you. Um, if you're ever up near Dover Hill, pay me a visit. There, I will really amaze you. Um, <coughs> I hope you will forgive my... So there we have it, another amazing feature they've added to this most amazing game. Uh, the actor is Kung Fu Panda's adopted father of the duck. I think it's James Hong but very distinctive voice he's got there. All right, guys, I'm going to be putting out a lot of videos today that I recorded quite a while ago. So stick around if you're interested in some more. And I want to say thanks for watching, and I want to catch you on the next one.